hello guys welcome back to another paintastic video uh, for this video i'm going to show you how i made a diy um, clay dough using non-sag epoxy sa hindi nakakaalam ng epoxy ito yung ginagamit uh, pang um, tawag nito pang tapal or pang uh, seal ng leak ng either sa tubo or sa roof or sa yung sa bangka para maiwasan yung pagtagas ng tubig. This time we're going to use this material for a different purpose. So if you are interested to learn how to make your own DIY clay dough or air dry clay using this material, so um, just stick to this video. Just stay with me until the end of this video so that you can somehow learn something from me. So let's get started. For the materials, we'll be needing non sag epoxy, set A and B. So this will be bought from any hardware store. And then we'll be needing cornstarch, yung sa cooking stove cornstarch. And then for our tools, we need palette knife or any scooping materials like teaspoon. And then wet wipes for uh, cleaning. What I like using this material is like talagang sturdy siya or matibay siya. So, yung output niya is para siyang bato or steel. So, once it's dry, talagang maganda yung effect niya. Isa pang maganda nito is mura lang siya. At saka nakikita nyo naman yung materials sa hardware store. And then, um, compared naman kasi na bumili ka pa ng yung commercialized na air dry clay, minsan kasi mahihitap hanapin sa art supply. So, kung wala kang makikitit ang uh, air dry clay sa art store ninyo, so, pwede yung gawin ito using epoxy clay or epoxy. Ang downside lang naman nito is talagang messy siyang gawin kasi, at saka matrabaho, and messy siya kasi kailangan mo po siyang i-mix together with the uh, um, together with the cornstarch and then kailangan masamasahin mo siya na parang dough. So, talaga matrabaho siya ka messy siyang gawin. But, sulit naman yung finished product niya. So, first thing we need to do is you we just get at least 2 or 1 tablespoon of cornstarch and then um, ihaluin lang natin both equal parts ng A, A na epoxy and saka B epoxy. And then we'll just mix together with the cornstarch and masamasahin lang siya until makuha natin yung tamang consistency. So we need to use a cornstarch para i-absorb niya yung moisture ng epoxy. And then para ano, hindi din siya didikit sa kamay mo while minamasa mo siya. Okay, one of the reasons why I showed you this process guys because for my next art piece, I'll be using this material and then yeah, abangan nyo din yung video na yun for another art piece that I will be showing you using this uh, clay, epoxy clay. consistency what we are looking for so elastic na siya hindi na siya agad agad na puputol so pwede na to siyang gamitin but uh, before siyang gamitin we will just rest this for about 2 minutes 2 or 3 minutes para maging medyo magdadry siya konti para mas uh, mabilis siyang um, i-form or i-work on after 2 or 3 minutes, you can now start using or manipulating your dough. So, you just have to move very fast kasi mabilis din siyang mag-dry. So, pwede na siyang gamitin to your any art projects. Okay, so, so I hope you learned something from me guys. I hope you like this video. So, if you are not subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe. Hit the like button. And then, 
um, click bell para you will be notified for my next video. Thank you guys. God bless.